Hello. So I finally got around to doing this. I did this, I don't know, like six years ago, more. Um, the Insomnia's Ultimate Gamer Challenge. I made the video as a joke and I didn't see the email that I had to be, that I was selected and had to be on the stage until that morning. I remember logging onto my computer in the LAN hall and just seeing the first email, clicked on it and went, what? <laughs> and all my friends came around and they were laughing and they said, you have to go. And I went, guys, I can barely stand. I can barely see. I'm still pissed. I can't do this. And uh, they insisted. They insisted on it. They all dragged me out there, pushed me backstage. Uh, I was met. There was a nice lady. I really, I, I really wish I'd got her name. There was a nice lady behind the stage. Uh, I remember one of the volunteers and she could see the state of disarray I was in because all the other guys were in like a little room. And I chose to lay out in the hall outside and just literally lay on my back and on my face, just trying to cool down because I was so fucking hungover. And this nice lady came over and just said, look, I've seen your video. I thought it was very funny. Are you OK? And I said, no, I'm very hungover. And she came over with loads of water and just kept feeding me water before I had to go on the stage. The downside to that, though, was I was absolutely busting for a piss uh, by the time I was even halfway through this show, this nightmare. As you can see, like my, my brain is not functioning at all. But anyway, I'll try and put some timestamps down in the comments because there's it's a long video. I was going to edit out lots of bits and I thought that's not fair. There was a lot of guys involved in this, like all the other competitors, the other YouTubers and stuff. And I thought they were they were all really fun and really cool. And they deserve uh, they deserve to be shown. It would be unfair of me to cut them out. So, yeah, enjoy. Live from the NEC in Birmingham, it's time to decide who will become Insomnia's Ultimate Gamer. Please welcome to the stage, your host, Darren Jeffries. Cheers, fella. Oh, hello. Hello. Get back there. Okay. Insomnia's Ultimate Gamer. That is what we are looking for, or who we are looking for. Uh, good counting, by the way, on the countdown. Who was that? Strong, very strong. And it's always good to know we have people in the audience that can count down from 10. It feels good. Right, okay, so, in so many years, also, you don't know what you're doing, Jason, do you? You all right, you're busy, aren't you? Okay, he's doing it, he's good, he's good. Okay, so, we are looking for Insomnia's ultimate gamer. Who thinks they've got what it takes? Well, unfortunately, you missed the boat because we already have them backstage. So basically, this was an online competition, okay? We had hundreds, hundreds of entries. Our production team spent weeks sifting through the madness. And basically, we asked um, our uh, entrants to uh, not only give us their best ever gaming moment, but try and get it across in some sort of a video or something like that so we can get an idea of personalities because this competition isn't just about gaming skills, it's about personalities too. So we asked them, yeah, for example, their greatest gaming achievement, etc., etc., and we chose seven favorites to compete in this live final on this stage here at the Insomnia Gaming Festival. It's intense, it's big. I'm taking this seriously. I want you guys to take this seriously too, all right? We're looking for the ultimate gamer. Okay, so what are the prizes? Let me tell you, this is unbelievable. I think this is, this could be the biggest prize we've ever given out on this stage, I think. So, a gaming PC worth over 1,500 pounds. That's just the beginning. I know, who wooed? Woo again, keep wooing. A monitor from AOC. So far, so good. A peripheral set from Rockat, which is a headset, keyboard, and mouse. A broadcasting kit from Razer, which is a microphone, webcam, and capture card. And then if that wasn't enough, we're also giving away 1,000 pounds in cash. For, I know from Multiplay and Dingit. So basically, whoever wins this, we're just setting them up for life. Maybe not for life, but for quite a while 
in terms of PC gaming. So, I think there's uh, one more thing to do. Bring everybody onto the stage. So, first of all, we're going to meet our judges. Our judges have been hand-picked by our Insomnia staff. And we're going to find out now what they're looking for in their ultimate gamer. First up, please welcome to the stage Nick from Razer. Here he is. You've got to dance, Nick. You've got to dance onto the stage. There we go. It was, wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad. So you are one of our esteemed judges. First of all, how does that feel? Confusing. Okay. <laughs> very, very confusing. They were like, Nick, do you want to judge this ultimate gamer? And I was like, okay. It's a good thing, though. Well, now I know what it is that I'm doing. Oh, cheers. Jason, you're, you're just saving the day every, everywhere I look. It's amazing. <laughs> yeah. um, so, Nick, but yeah, but let's, let's, let's be honest. You've met a lot of gamers in your time. You do work for Razer. I work with a lot of the YouTubers and a lot of the Twitch streamers. Yep. Uh, and uh, in supporting them with hardware. Um, that's turned into supporting with advice and stuff like that as well. Yeah. So yep. I do. It was, it's one of those things of you don't know that you know it until someone goes, well, actually, you know all this sort of stuff. And you go, exactly. Oh, yeah. yeah. And that's why you're here. Yes. Um, and of course, as well, you've been coming to Insomnia for such a long time. You know what we're looking for in terms of an ultimate gamer. Like I said, not just gaming skills, the whole package. It's, it's about uh, gaming skills. It's about how entertaining they are, whether they win or lose. Yeah. It's about how much fun they are showing they're having when they're playing. Interesting. I like it. That's what I'm looking for. I was going to ask, yeah, so anything specific, what, what you want personality, basically? I'm looking for someone that kind of drags me into the way they're, when they're playing. So if you look at some of the really good uh, Twitch streamers and YouTubers, you're watching their videos and you're like, this is, it just engages you. And next thing you know, you're at the end of the video and you haven't noticed the time passing, but you've had fun. That's what I'm kind of looking for is going to be those guys that are telling me what they're up to, the strategies maybe that they're using, that sort of thing, and also how much they're enjoying the game. Okay, right, good stuff. I think you're the man for the job, absolutely. So we have a podium here. Would you like to go and stand in front of it? It's very official. Oh, bloody. We're not going to bring it to you, are we? <laughs> go on, off you go. Health and safety, Nick. The stairs there. Huh? I was saying health and safety. I missed him by miles. Okay. You ready? You ready? I'm good. It's very official, that, isn't it? I, I was saying, you need this for... The you people behind you can't see, though. That's the problem. You need this for kids. Okay, thank you. Right. You might need to like crouch a bit, Nick. So the guys behind can see. Right, our next judge. He knows what he's talking about because he's a YouTuber. It's Gizzy Gaza. Here he is. I know. I know. He's behind me, isn't he? There you are. How are you doing? I'd shake your hand with the full. There we go. Are you well, mate? Good. Yep. Oh, there's your mic. He's there. Sorry, I should have there said. There you go. I didn't know where the mic was. There you go. This young man with the balloon was very happy to hear you're on this stage. Hello. Great stuff. Right, so, uh, you know the score. You know what we're looking for here. But what are you looking for? I'm looking for fun, personality, good at the game, ideally. Um, just someone who can make me feel like I'm having a good time. Okay. So. I think with the prize as well, we're setting this person up to potentially be a massive YouTuber. Sure. Potentially. So, no pressure. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I'm having fun. This is okay. going to be good. Good no stuff. Pressure. Good stuff. Uh, are you happy to join Nick at the podium? Do I sit in the middle or do I go? The uh, use the stairs, please. Where is this? Uh, there. Yeah. Off you go, Kizzy. Round of applause for Kizzy, please. Okay, Giz. Confident. Like it. Look at that walk. That's a man who knows what he's doing. High five in the audience, love it. Right, okay, finally, our third judge. You've already seen him, he's here, but he's busy at the moment, I think. He's working, Jason. You can't even hear me. Jason. Jason. J Jason! Hello! How's Sorry, everybody James. doing? Are you busy? Like, seriously, are you in the middle of something or...? We're nearly there. We're okay. nearly there. What we'll do is have a quick chat and you can go back to helping out, okay? Sure, sure. So, uh, as discussed, we are looking for our ultimate gamer. Oh, this yes. is Jason from Bone Loaf, by the way. So, basically, Jason uh, played a big part in the creation of Gang Beasts. Who's Gang Beasts! As you may have guessed, this man is responsible. So, Jason, what are you looking for? 
What am I looking for? I'm looking for the best player, the most precise player. No messing around. I want to see the job done, the win gained, and the competition destroyed. So okay. let's have let's have a Gangby style winner yeah. coming in to show how to play games. Well, this is interesting because Gang Beasts is very personality based in terms of video games. So I think you're the perfect man for the job in terms of looking for someone who has a personality. Absolutely. Yeah, like it. All right, well, um, I know you're busy setting this up, okay, but when you're look. ready, just stand behind the podium. Excellent. Okay. Thanks so much. Cheers, Jason. Thank you so much. Right. So we've had our judges. I think now it is time to bring on our YouTubers. Yes, these guys are going to be teaming up with our audience members in order to help them do their very best when it comes to in, uh, impressing our judges. So very quickly, we have Brown Man. We have Tina Dayton. We have not me, not Shadow me. Lady. And we have Razbowski. Out you come, guys. All of you, join us. Hello. Oh, How are you? Are the other two coming out as well? Oh, there is, is Raz. Hello. Shadow Let's Lady, hello, hello, hello. 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 There you go, it works now. Yes. I think we've established that history is being made on this stage. We are looking for Insomnia's ultimate gamer. How does it feel to be playing a part in that process? Mistakes have been made. I don't know why I'm up here. But yeah. I'll do my best. <laughs> okay. It's, I mean, you're going to help these guys out, hopefully help them shine, impress our judges. Sure. What Absolutely. would you like to see, though, in our ultimate game? What are you looking for, do you think? A good loser. Because <laughs> if you're going to be on my team, you ain't winning. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Okay, good, good. Tina, what do you think makes an ultimate gamer? Personality. Yes, personality goes a long, long way. Yeah. It doesn't really work if you're a YouTuber without a personality, does it? You kind of have to up your game slightly. Yeah. Yeah. Raz? Oh, oh, a winner, baby. They've got a win. Okay. They want to win, they got to win, you know what I'm saying? Well, winning is a thing, but at the same time, our judges have been told already they're looking for personality too. You don't necessarily have to be good at games to be a successful YouTuber or streamer, do you? Sometimes the whole point is being bad at them. <laughs> LD Shadow Lady, what do you think? It's definitely not all about skill, as I have proved. It's about <laughs> passion. Okay, so you're looking for passion over... Professionalism. Yeah, I don't over, want to talk yeah. Professional yeah. passion, yeah. yes. Passion okay. over skill. Brilliant. Um, I don't know where to put you. It's going to be a really busy stage. Um, should we put you at the stations for now? What do we think, guys? Production? We'll leave you there for now. Is that okay? Yeah. yeah. I'm not going to lie. Right. I don't know where to put you. Okay? But it's fine. It's fine. Okay. Last but not least. Oh. Silence, please, for our contestants. This is big. First up, we have Chris Wheatley. Chris, join us on the stage, my friend. Chris Wheatley. It's very nice to meet the man in person. I've heard a lot about you. I've heard a lot about all our audience members. All good, mate. How are you feeling? This is, this is big. Yeah, it's big, but it's a game. So, for out with the personality straight away. I like that. I like that, Chris. Um, how did you um, enter the competition? What was your biggest gaming achievement? Uh, it was actually completing Skyrim on Legendary with only using my fists. Right. Uh, okay. For, from the off, that's impressive. Well done. How long did that take? 500 hours. Five. It took me 500 hours to complete the game normally, never mind with fists. I completed it before. That's impressive. Okay. Um, what about the prize? I mean, there's a lot of pressure here, I think. There's a lot to win. There's a lot to win, but you've, we're always coming in to win. But, of course, you've got to have fun whilst doing it. Now that, that is what I like to hear. The judges are impressed by that. You're already playing the game. Yes. I like it. Well done. Okay, for now, mate, if you want to take a seat, that would be great. Next up, we have Tom Chaplin. Here he is. Round of applause, please. Yes. There he is. I knew that. Tom, welcome. Thank you. How are you feeling? A little bit nervous, but uh, feeling good. Understandably so, you know, this is a big deal. Um, in terms of your gaming achievement, what do we got? Uh, probably my, my best achievement is being the first person to actually win the first official Halo 3 tournament back in 2007. 
which broadcast live on TV. Hey, good to see some fans. <laughs> and uh, also beat some of the best UK players at Halo 2 at the time as well. So that was a good result. And that is why you're here on this stage. Well done. Yeah, thank you. Congratulations. And what about today? What's your, what's your approach going to be? Uh, I think it would be a bit too much to say wing it, but uh, I suppose just take it how it comes and uh, see how we do. The judges are nod nodding in agreement. Great. Okay, take a seat, Tom. Next up, we have Chavez Khan. <laughs> Chavez, how are you doing? Join me here, my friend. How are you, fella? You well? Yeah, yeah, I'm all good. How are you? I'm not too bad. Thanks for asking. It's always nice when I get asked that. Um, so, you, you're winning me. He's won me over already. Um, basically, obviously, this is all based on gaming achievements, personalities. What was your gaming achievement? How did you do? Um, the main gaming achievement I had was I went professional in Mortal Kombat X. I, I started making a name for myself through that game, specifically. And um, it was always something I wanted to do as a kid because I grew up with the franchise and throughout the years I just grew up loving it even more. So you're basically amazing at Mortal Kombat? I could have been better, but I like to think I'm pretty good. Modesty! We like modesty as well! Well done! Take a seat, my friend. Okay, so we're going to play four players on Gang Beast, so we're missing one. Actually, Chavez, you can sit on this chair if you want, mate. There's room. Okay. <laughs> Our fourth contestant for this round is Lewis Nicholas Mills. He has a double barrel surname, people. Here he is. Lewis, get over here. How are you, Lou? Good, thank you. Yeah. Uh, how are you feeling about being here today? I'm pretty, pretty excited. Yeah. yeah. Nervous? Yeah, a bit nervous, yeah. But don't blame you. It's a big prize. Uh, what was your gaming achievement out of interest? I, um, I completed Halo 4 and Legendary three times in a day. Three t in one day? Yeah. Round of applause, please. I think so, yeah. And uh, what's your tactic today? How are you going to approach this? I'm just sort of going to button mash. It usually, usually works, yeah. Button bashing? Yeah. Okay, take a seat. If only he was judged on hair, I think he'd be our winner. Judges, do you agree? <laughs> I know, Jason. Tell me about it. Tell me about it. Well done, my friend. Okay, so these are our first four contestants. We have three more to come, but for now, you guys are playing a Gang Beasts Smackdown. Controllers, um, I, I'm guessing, uh, Liam, can you guide me in terms of the controllers? Am I doing this right? Which ones are we grabbing? Where's Liam? Come on, Liam. Out you come. I'm assuming it's those two, but I don't want to give you a bum steer. Liam, there you go. Which controllers, mate? Just these ones. Oh, so you guys need to come and sit on this couch. <laughs> Come on, quick. My bad. Okay. Let's move over there. Not if you've played Gang Beasts before. No? Ooh, Chris, not the best start. Do you guys Top? know the controls of Gang Beasts? Chavez, Lewis, have you played Gang Beasts before? No, none of them. Jason, yes. fascinating that none of them have played Gang Beasts before. Okay. Talk them through it. Quick rundown for Gang Beasts. You L1 and R1 are your punch buttons. Left, right, and left hand and right hand. Left for left, right for right. If you tap that button, it punches. If you hold that button, it grabs with that hand. So you can grab with one hand, punch with the other. Uh, you can grab with both hands and throw headbutts in. Uh, if you hold the Y button, the character puts his arms in the air, which you can use to lift players. Uh, red button is headbutt, blue button is kick. Use a jump with those to get some diving headbutts and some flying kicks in. And if you get knocked out, just smash that green button as quickly as you can to get back up. How's that sound, guys? Okay. So um, you're not mic'd up, so I'm not really sure how we're going to judge this based on personality. But I'm guessing you're going to have to just use your eyes. No idea what's going on. Right, okay. So are you ready, guys? Ready to rock? Choose your players. Have we got the screen up? Okay. I would advise, if you want any chance of success, avoid capes, guys. Oh, insider's capes. tip there. You're one. I like the guy with the moustache. Oh, no, he shaved. Play one. Your chicken. Yeah. Two, four, and Chavez, your three, yes? I like the purple loot. Okay. Or the do, you guys, do you guys mind swapping? Because that would make it easier in terms of... It's so cozy on there, isn't it? 
that makes it easier in terms of like, okay, so we've got player one, two, three, and four. Brilliant. Choose your players. Okay, are you all ready? Tom, you just got to choose yours, mate, and then we're going in. Audience, who's familiar with Gang Beasts? Quite a few of you. Good, good. I've played. And we're in the wrestling ring. Good start. Strong start. Play. Oh, God. It's Jason, go on, talk us through it. What are we seeing, mate? So what we got? We're in the ring level. Oh, We've got four guys go playing on, it out. They seem to have paired off. Throw each other here and there. Oh, no. Still it on the left-hand side. Red's just been kicked in the face. Blue and green, uh, sorry, blue and yellow having a bit of a dance, but they've been split up by the other two players. Fists are flying everywhere. Jeez. Oh, so Purple's uh, headed up front to uh, oh, provoke everybody with his amazing dance moves. The red Red's one is dead. Down. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Mustache is sort of doing his own thing over here. I feel like the Luchador has a home field advantage right now. You're <laughs> in the ring, kind of flailing around. Red's doing some, so red, red and yellow are dancing, good. I love it. It's, it's purple. I like purple style. A lot of flair going on over there. A lot of passion. A lot of, a lot of passion coming from purple. It's such a oh, oh, nice push tag. there by Yellow Chicken. Red is oh, dead again. Red is back up. Oh, the cape almost took him out. Oh. This could be a stalemate if nobody manages to get anyone out. Everybody's sort of hugging at the moment, having sort of a, a, a love fest as opposed to a fight. So you need to throw What's them up, over throwing the ropes, punches, right? my boys. <laughs> throw some punches. There's a lot of lifting and jumping, not a lot of blows being laid. Yeah, let's see some punches, guys. Come on. Let's see some kicks. I want some violence. <laughs> Friendly punches, of course. Aww. So, Ray, can you help me out here? Do you know whose characters, who's who? Uh, I, no. no? I, I, okay. I, I like the purple luchador, though. Or the oh, pink luchador. The that's okay. what I'm rooting for. Who's... Oh, that's what I like to see. I believe it's player I mean, three. these guys are playing for such big prizes. I don't really oh. want to interrupt them, so oh, we'll just... We'll just go with it. Yeah. It's gang beasts. Who cares? It's meant to be mad. Right. Chicken is taking a beating. The teal dude is trying, man. But He's working on it. <laughs> I like the very strategic press all the buttons tactics that everyone's using right now. It's working out very well. That poor chi Oh, no. Oh, the red one's oh. getting bullied right now. Oh, my God. Leave the dad alone. <laughs> just he's got his suit and tie on. He's ready to go to work, and you're just beating him up. Come on. He forgot his pants, Leave though. Him alone. He's it's not like really a dad, ready. like, kids, get ready for school. Please stop beating dad. I know mom's not here, but please. Please, mom, dad, stop oh. fighting. I'm seeing a lot of bu button mashing here. <laughs> there's, 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 some, there's some good tactics going on. And the dad's down. This does tend to happen with people that haven't played Gang Beast before, doesn't it? It's just a circle yeah. of button bashing and no you've got, actual... You've got to pick them up. That's what you've got to do. You've got to throw <laughs> Apparently the chicken has won already. Oh, what my God. Oh, no, no! Go, Someone's go, grasped go. it. Oh, oh. Somebody's close. grasped it. Someone gets it. Close. Can someone get on the turnbuckle and do, like, an elbow drop? <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, 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 my pro oh, what happened? Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, no. The ultimate stalemate. I think Who they're all eliminated. The gamer is Who the game. Who was that? Who did that? Who's going to admit to it? One of you did that. <laughs> no, I love how none of you are uh, admitting to that. You're in trouble now. Uh-oh. Who's breaking my game? It does happen. Don't worry. Even the YouTubers do that sometimes. Don't worry about it. Reassure them. YouTubers, reassure them. It's fine. Oh, no, I've done it thousands. It, it does happen. It does happen. What you guys have got to be careful of is pressing the X button, the home button. So much button mashing that you've mashed the start button and it's quit the game. So guys, um, we're gonna. I just want to hear how you feel so far. Obviously, they need to get a feel for you guys as gamers. Uh, Lewis, how do you feel, mate? What are you thinking? I'm, I'm shaking. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty nervous. Okay. You see me? You don't see me? You lying? You're playing Today's... it off well. Man, I'm a purple luchador, dude. I just go with the rhythm, you know. I just go with my heart's feeling. Deep and cool. That's what I would say Chavez was. Okay, Tom. I think it's a bit of a free for all, to be honest. It's quite chaotic, but it's kind of like that controlled chaotic sort of thing. Sensible, Tom, isn't he? He's sensible. That's not a bad thing, though. Not a bad thing. And then Chris, thoughts? I have no clue what I'm doing, but I'm having fun. He's a winger. He's just winging it. Why not? Right, can we get you back in the game then, guys? You're dealing with this very well, I have to say. Maybe this was part of it. Maybe this is some sort of a test. Okay, are we ready to rock? 
I think we're just waiting on... Yeah, okay, we're going in. So watch, though, watch the home button, yeah? Don't tap it. All right, here we go. Are you all the same? I think we got a blue chicken this time and, like, another dad. Oh, no, it's, like, a business okay. guy in yellow. Oh, he's yeah, going to fight the dad. That guy's brought dad his glasses. Fights. Death I guess fight. in some ways that was a good warm up. These guys now know that they need to pick each other up and chuck each other out. There should Are be a clear win. Oh! Two and oh! What happened? Double! Whoa. Double! Kill. The double Whoa. Come on, Two. Dad! Oh, come on, come on Dad! <laughs> Who can Who's do this? Out? Who's out? Oh, oh. oh what? Oh, what? Oh. what? Oh. what? Oh. Who won? Who's player? Oh, the, the luchador. I knew it. I picked the winner. That? Okay, that was crazy. Okay. I feel like the luchador and the red man is like good dad and bad dad. <laughs> So, I think that was Lewis and Chris, unfortunately, who got chucked out there. Oh. Chavez won it. Oh, no. I think they were schooling us first time. They wanted more stage time, so they were like, we'll dance around yeah. for a little bit. Yeah, there was a marked difference between those two games. It was a big difference. <laughs> it's like, what? They were playing us for fools. Yeah, exactly. Once the chicken suit comes off, things get real. Oh, 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 right oh, there, no. Right there. Oh, oh. oh, no. That was nasty. So you guys aren't our judges, but I, I, I care about your opinion. Who do you think so far, just don't let them know, just point to them. Who do you think has potential? Okay, all I'm, pointing I'm at the same person now, I think. Oh, no. You come for, okay, interesting. All right, okay. I like the code, that was a good yeah, code. Yeah, good. yeah. <laughs> we'll see if that changes. I don't know who they are in the ring, oh. but the, the Reds do oh. really well. Oh, oh no. that was, oh. He went under the rope. Lewis, no I don't think Gang Beats is your game. I keep dying. Yeah, oh. you do keep dying. It's okay. Don't worry, it's not judged on gaming skills, so... And you've still got the hair. That's true. Right, here we go. Right now... The, oh, Dad! They're tag teaming Dad. He's literally there. my dad. I've called oh. him so many times. <laughs> But the thing is, are they going to team up to bully one? Sometimes it takes The dad work. comes in to break it up. That's it. So is the yellow player just dead outside the ring? That's them done. <laughs> oh, purple luchador oh. looks not looking oh. great right now. <laughs> oh, 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 my God. Oh, my God. Like a diamond cutter. Superman's back in there. <laughs> Super luchador. Super luchador. Oh, you got taken out, chicken man. Oh, chicken man's back up. Oh, kicking him while he's down. It's just, it's just, it is literally a free for all. There's no teamwork. It's just violence, and I love it. There's I want to know what Jason thinks. Around, a lot of butt mashing. Jason, being, well, all three of you, actually, you can pass the mic down. Dad, what are you thinking going? so far? Right. Oh, they overall, look overall, overall. No favorites just yet. Come on, guys. No favorites, huh? Come on, you don't get Simon Cowell and Sharon just passing the mic around. Oh we, don't, God. we need to hear your input. Oh. Come on. They're, they're, they're scared to criticize. Um, I'm going to go at the minute. Yeah, I've been really enjoying myself. Yeah, and I'm really enjoying watching their facial <laughs> reactions as well. But, okay. Yeah, they're all getting quite focused. So I think they need to just the sort of like play. start entertaining just us. Me a every time. Okay. <laughs> yeah, uh, kind of echoing what Nick said. Just everyone's having a lot of fun, but like. To begin with, but now everyone's like very focused on like I need to win, and everyone's oh, really oh, quiet. Oh, oh, I, oh, oh, no. I think the focus is coming. Oh, I think the focus is oh chicken, one. yes! Oh, I'm so proud of you, Chris. That was a nice comeback, oh. my friend. Jeez, chicken man. Yeah, you guys mentioned there's been a lot of focus, but I think that's the fact that they're playing for like five thousand pounds worth of gear. You know, it's, it's, there's a lot of pressure. Competition is oh, stiff. No. It's steep. But they all want the win and they're all going for it. They just gotta remember it's not all about them sat there. What about all of us oh guys? Oh no, we've come to the show. There is, Go, that. Chicken. there is that. Go! Oh okay. little chicken, I believe. So I this Lewis, was gonna be a redemption. Game for you, you are not gang beasts. You're not gang beasts. Oh, but that's okay. Oh, you can't be oh, 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 kick him out! Oh, kick him! Oh, oh, kick him! Oh, 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 nice comeback, Chris. You're a monster. Good job, dude. You're no chicken, mate. <laughs> this is it. This is yellow's round. I oh, I'm, I'm kind of oh. rooting for the yellow now. Because yeah, come on. I want to know what the audience is like. Just audience. play dead. Come on, Lewis. Just stay in the audience. corner and lie down. No! No! Oh, oh, chicken. Oh, 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 chicken. Go on, Lewis. Audience, what are your thoughts? No, yellow stay on, on our game is so far. <laughs> Make some noise. Make some oh noise if, if Lewis is rocking oh your world. Oh my god. No one. 
Gervais. Yeah. He had one over there. Big some Gervais man. fans over there. Probably Gervais' his family, but we don't talk about that. <laughs> Tom. Tom Chaplin. Anyone? Oh. Woo! I got you. They're a quiet audience, don't worry. <laughs> and then Chris. Come on. Woo! No one. Chris. I got you. Okay, none of them want you. any of you I to win this, just so you know. Chicken. I got you, man. Moving on. You got no support from anybody. <laughs> yeah. At least they all don't like you the same amount. It yeah. would have been a bit more. Yeah. It's all good. Right. It's very intense this round. It is. It is. <laughs> Blue and I mean yellow and red look like they're having having some issues. Shouldn't you all bully the chicken because he's won the past two well, rounds? Oh. Oh. Darren. Darren. Can we get some live comments from the players? I don't know what's going on over there. I think. They're playing for a lot of a lot of money here. I don't want to interrupt their flow. I think that's a bit unfair. Let's wait till the game's over and then we'll we'll have a conf lap. Okay. Okay. And judges, get back in your box. Well, oh. you know, we're here to do a job. Alright, rain it in a little bit, alright? It's not the X Factor. Who do you want to judge? <laughs> Anybody? I thought you got the professionals in. Do you know what? You give them a podium and this is what you get. Yeah, well, you gave us the podium. Just Where's I know my what buzzer? I'm doing. Where's my buzzer? Yeah. We're gonna chat for them after. No, thank Bop. God we don't have buzzers. That'd be Terrible. Oh, 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 oh chicken, oh, chicken. Oh, oh, chicken. Oh, 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 over. Come, Come on, on Yoa. You've almost it got him. It is gang fight. Almost got him, buddy. Keep on the aggressive behavior. I love it. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 He's got him by the foot. <laughs> it's an him. interesting strategy. Him. Oh. Spin him around. Oh. Oh. Take him out with See you. That. Go. Oh. Did you see that? Okay. Lewis is raging slightly. Oh my god. But then again, some people like rages, this don't they? Some people yeah. like to see a YouTuber oh. rage. Passion. So yeah, oh. let him rage. Happy rage away. Yeah, if you're don't hurt, just let it out. Oh. Get him out! Oh. Get him out! Oh, he's still in! Oh. Oh. Chavez. Oh. Finally, something happened. <laughs> Finally. Finally. Lewis. Oh, God. You hang in there, buddy. <laughs> now, this is it. T team up. Get chicken. Chicken's winning. Why don't you team up on the chicken? Come on. Tactics, boys. This makes sense. I think they just don't like dad. Look at him. He's, <laughs> just getting, he's getting destroyed right now. Just so you know, guys, this is our final match. You know, it's pants all on. Not to play for, but to prove. Okay. You've got to take out the chicken if you take guys want to win. Take out the chicken if you want a chance. Butcher it. Oh, go, oh, go, no. go, Oh, oh chicken I dead. was rude for you. Right, here we go. There we oh, have it. Oh, oh. oh. Yeah. This is grudge. Let me show you. Oh, oh, God. Get He's just kicking you around. Get up. Classic red versus blue, isn't There's it? so much to live for. This is guys. between Tom and Chris. Use the moustache. Do you think after this, Red Dad goes to work and just tells the story about how he got destroyed in the ring by a chicken? Do you think anyone believes Red Dad? <laughs> Nobody believes him. He goes home, tells his kids, guess what, I was fighting a chicken today. And they're like, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh Red oh, Dad! Dad! And I won, kids! I won! <laughs> right, okay. So, really quickly, um, I'm gonna bring you all up one by one. We'll have a little chat, okay, judges? This is your time to analyze. Okay, so first up, Lewis. Up you come, mate. So it seems to me, Lewis, that you're a Killed bit of a rager. Two, a True? A little bit. I'm not good at that game, though. Yeah. I'm not good at it. Whereabouts are you from? Uh, Lincolnshire. Right, okay, cool. I noticed the accent. So yeah, I mean, we were just saying, though, some people like a rager. Some people like it when a YouTuber goes a bit mad. I know, I love it. This man, was, I mean, he's a lovely guy, but while playing, he got a bit angry. That's uh, fine, though, as far as I'm concerned. As a YouTuber, I love seeing the reactions. So. Yeah. Reactions are good. Reactions yes. are good. Okay, so you did a good job as far as we're concerned. Take a seat, mate. Okay, next up, Chavez, hope you come, mate. Now, Chavez, you're very cool, very calm, very collected. <laughs> but you lost. Yeah, uh, I suck. <laughs> okay. Modest again. Um, like, I couldn't really get my head around the whole, like, grabbing someone, just lifting him above your head and just throwing him at the ring. It's an easy enough concept, but, you know, the controls are pretty tricky, but... Okay. You're saying that you're a peaceful guy, you don't, you just don't see the... You're not a fighter. No, no, I was fully going for the slaughter on everyone, but <laughs> it just didn't work out. Okay. Yes, Gervais, happy? Gervais, Gervais okay. I was really hoping, being a fighting game heritage, that you were just going to rule on that one, man. What happened? 
What happened? We were hoping for like, you know, finishing moves, suplex, knock him out, throw him out. I mean, he's, he's very aggressive, don't worry, he gets like this. <laughs> right, okay. Tom, up you come, mate. Now, Tom, I, I had you pegged as Mr. Sensible, yeah? But then during that game, you got quite aggressive. I've noticed a tattoo. You're a, you're a dark horse, I think. I'd probably say that, yeah. I think my tactic for that was kind of see how the holds went, see if I could try and just throw people out of the ring. But then once that's found out I didn't, that it didn't really work. I thought, oh, maybe try and go for a bit more kind of offensive, a bit more hard hitting, see if I can knock people out and then just, just roll them out of the ring. I like you, Tom. Yeah, I think he's a dark horse. Take a seat. Okay, and last but not least, Chris, up you come, mate. Woo! Okay, so back to personality, I'll give you that. And a bit of a win as well, well done. Yeah, too round bad. Had to go with the chicken for a bit of irony. Humor. I, I like it. Hello. I like it. And um, what about the actual game Gang Beast? You'd never played it before. How did you find it? It was actually a good one. You get to learn the controls really quickly, and it's just like, knock him out, and then just kick him. Exactly. He knows what he's doing, this guy. Absolutely. It's not up to me, though. Chris, take a seat, mate. Three more audience members. Out they come. First of all, Craig Patterson. Oh. Woo! Craig Patterson. Oh! Yeah, boy. Okay, let's be honest. Craig, draw me over here, mate. Okay, from the off, Craig, you clearly know how to make an entrance. You enjoyed that, didn't you? I am very hungover, oh, and yeah. you're being very loud. How are you feeling? No. You're not, you don't even want to speak to me? No. Okay, well, that was a really good entrance. You had that. Take a seat, mate. He's regretting this. Dark and mysterious. I like this one. Okay, did a friend put you up to this? Did a friend put you up to this? Are you hungover? Right, that's thought so. Thought so. Okay, next up, Robin Ed. Out you come, mate. Whoa, 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 whoa! 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 Yes, Robin. Yep. Jason, he's got a beard like I yours. I know, I've got this. Are you onto the beard? Got Just like yours. How are you feeling, my friend? Pretty good. Yeah. Yep. Looking forward to this? Yep. Any particular tactics? Uh, not really. No, you have to throw them off the map. <laughs> Are you hungover? Sorry? Are you hungover? Nope. You, you could already be winning then. Yes. Take a seat. <laughs> there we go. Um, Craig, have you even slept? Just out of interest. Okay, you're doing all right. You'll be fine, mate. Okay, next up, Steve Chilton. <laughs> confident. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was a confident wave, I think. <laughs> oh, yeah. How are you doing? Look at his T-shirt. Show the audience. Yeah, he's a charmer. Does it also count to men, though? Huh? Does it also count to men? It, well, it's up to you. You can just read into that however I, I you want. No apologies to the males out there. Okay. We Steve, you clearly got an eye for the ladies. Anything else? Not much, really. Okay. Are you feeling confident? I think so. I think yeah. I've done the competition. All right. Well, we'll just see how you get on, mate. Take a seat. Right, so we're, we're going to play Gang Beast again, okay? Don't fall asleep. Keep him up. Keep him away. Stay away. Right, okay. So, Gang Beasts, choose your player, and then in we go. Just so you know, the blue chicken is good luck. Ooh. Darren. Sorry, no, is, there. is there not a fourth player? No, that's it. Oh, we, wow. did have a, we did have a lady dad, who was meant to take children. part, but she didn't turn up. Well, she gets to miss. Her loss, that's what I say. Absolutely. Right. One dead end. Don't oh, miss. We're in. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Hello. Right off. Oh, this oh, is my brutal. God. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh. Oh. Who is that? Okay. Oh, 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 Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. immediate. What a save. <laughs> oh, the dad is on fire. <laughs> it's a blue dad today. It's a blue dad, yeah. Yeah, white blue dad. It's a bit cold. <laughs> LBD. So, judges, just so you know, we've got Craig, Robin, and then Steve. 
This is a lot more. Oh, oh he's my kicked God. him oh, under. Oh, 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 no. Oh, he almost came back. Almost Steve's out. Safe, he's just almost kicking safe. him in the face. Hey, you brutal, Have mercy. Hey. Leave him alone. He's already dead. He's gone. Oh, my God. Come on. You're an older gentleman. Kick him out. You should know. Kick him out. <laughs> no, cut. Oh, Pull him on. Let him out. Pull him down with you. Let him this is crew. Down this is crew. You. Hold no. on. Look how small, Craig's doing all right, isn't he, considering? Let's be honest. Right, one more game, guys, come on. That was quick. It was done. You won in like two minutes. I think one of you's paused it, that's all. Jason, is that true? It was only two lines. Oh, okay, wow, that was really fast. Okay, um, Steve, up you come, mate. Three rounds, yeah. No wow. idea what's going on. One or three. Steve, how did you find that? I mean, it was very short, but very sweet. Uh, I yeah, I kind of got wrecked. First time playing Gang Beast, though. Oh, well, that's fair enough then. And can I ask, what was your gaming achievement? I reached the top 10 in the world on a uh, fighting game. Okay. In the world? In the world. Top 10 in the world. Can, can and he's we, obviously dealt with it well. There's no ego here at all. Can we get any hints on what fighting game? What was the fighting game? It's uh, quite an embarrassing, but it's Dragon Ball Raging Blast 2. It was quite an old one on the Xbox. Why is that embarrassing? But he's not it's Rumble niche, Roses, so you're it's okay. It's a niche category because the mainstream are Street Fighter and Marvel, and uh, Good one. it's not one that's popular. Who cares? You're at the Insomnia Gaming Festival, my friend. Any game goes. Right. Thank you, mate. Do you want to take a seat quickly? And then we'll bring up Robin. Over you come, mate. Robin, I, I think Gizzy Gazza quite likes you. He's, his eyes lit up when you got up then. You've got, <laughs> I think you've got a fan there. Uh, how did that go for you? It was all planned. Really? The jump out of the map, yeah. that just ended. Really? Why? Shown off. Honest. Honest. I like it. Fine. Yeah. Okay. Fine. I like a show off. Sit down. Uh, Craig, do you want to come up or do you want to just stay there? Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, indeed. Okay, Craig. Um, we watched all your videos, by the way, that you sent in. Yours was quite amusing. So, oh, but we've seen a lack of that now. What? Did you remember you were taking part in this competition last night? No. Okay. How many Jaeger bombs? I drank it. Okay, fine. Sit down. Darren. It's okay. It's okay. Darren, Darren, can we, can we see the video that was quite amusing? What's that? Sorry? Can we see this video that was quite amusing? No. It's X-rated. Ah, uh, okay. Right. So, there we have it. Now what we're going to do is put you into two sides and play Rocket League, okay? Have you guys played Rocket League before? Some of you were really happy about that, some of you weren't. Show our hands who's played Rocket League before and who hasn't. Okay, fair enough. It's quite simple anyway. Gizzy, do you mind, Gizzy? What are you doing? Gizzy, what, what, what's going on? Whoa. Where is she? Really? This is a young lady that should have turned up. She's just realized what's going on. <laughs> Why didn't you say anything? checked my email, so I like just found it out now. I checked on my friend's phone. I don't know what to say. <laughs> I do. Check your email. If only you jo I mean, I need to speak to production about this. Guys, can we, is this allowed? I don't know, it's unprecedented. <laughs> right, so uh, what we're gonna do is pit you against each other. We're gonna team you up with a YouTuber. Now, this is gonna be interesting because we're gonna ask you guys as well to choose your favourites. We're going to get an idea of which way you're leaning. I think it's going to be very interesting. Don't feel too bad. Ray, yes. if you were to team up with any of our contestants, who would it be? Who, who's your personal favourite? This doesn't necessarily mean that they're everybody's favourite, but what are you looking for and who have you chosen? How can I not pick this gentleman with that attitude? Okay. He's clearly an all-star. Yeah, Ray likes an attitude. Okay. If you want to make your way to the station here, please. <laughs> But of course, um, we need to actually, I've just realized, you can still stay there, but we need you guys to whittle this down, don't we? I totally forgot. Yeah, sorry, why didn't you tell me? So, have you guys chose? Okay, how long will you be, just out of interest? How long are you gonna be, just out of interest? A minute. Okay. Me? I haven't got any. Right, 
So as our judges deliberate on who's going to go through to the next round, I got a bit excited then, sorry. <laughs> I love your passion. Yeah. Hopefully um, Craig's made it through, because that would be really awkward. But we'll, <laughs> we'll find out in a bit, I suppose. Um, so guys, about choosing, because we are going to have you choose who you team up with, but just out of interest, um, what's impressed you so far, overall, when it comes to our contestants? Nothing. You're just not impressed. Tina, you're not impressed at all, are you? No. Uh, I'm... I'll tell you what I'm impressed by. Okay, let's hear it. The fact that they're coping quite well with what is quite a confusing situation, I think. I, I agree. Yes. 110%. Yeah, are, I think they're dealing they with this very well. well. Yeah, they're coping with the madness Good quite job, well. Guys. It's a lot to play for, you know? Yeah. I think, Raz? I think everybody in their individual ways is coping really well, whether it's the cool cam exterior or the madness with the rage. But every, everybody seemed to enjoy themselves so far, which is the main purpose. Good answer. Fully formed. I practiced at home. <laughs> <laughs> LD? I haven't really seen a lot of passion. I've seen a bit of rage, and I've seen a lot of button mashing, but no real passion. Right, okay, good point. You want to see more passion, yeah. No, I'm with you there, now that you've mentioned we have, uh, it. Four. Yeah, if you guys really want to win this prize, let's see some more passion, okay? Please. I get that you might be a little bit nervous, but come on, let's see that energy. Yes, we have good a point. Four. You have your four. We have the four. Okay, guys, it's up to you. Go for it. Can you please mention why you chose these four as well, of course? Okay. Okay. Chris. I picked Chris. I liked his competitiveness. I liked how he just fought for fun and won and just owned it. So that's, yeah, good. Good stuff. Chris, take a seat, mate. Round of applause for Chris, please. This is big. Three left. Sorry, Craig. Sorry, mate. Do you want to sit back here just in case? You never know. It could be awkward. <laughs> Next. Well, uh, we actually like Craig as well. We Thank he, God for he, that. He's good at the game, and he's a fan favorite, and I'm he's enjoyable to watch, yep. and he's relatable. And he's hungover. Uh, yep, and he's just, he's fun. I'm glad you said that. I thought you might hit me. Okay. And he has uh, a not give a poop style. Okay. He turned up, he's rocked it, and he owned everybody. Okay, okay, well, you're the judges. Yeah, just, just as I say that he makes good use of the pockets on his cargo pants as well. Okay. Very good use. All right, he's not, he, all right, he's not God. Yeah, <laughs> come on, <laughs> Loving it. This one. Okay. Flirting, stop it. Look at you all. all right. If you could see the judges' eyes now, they're like, they're looking at him like he's a dreamboat. They're just like, anyway, right, next, two left. Lover. Okay, all right, uh, yes, uh, so our third pick is going to be, um, the very posh sounding Lewis Nicholas Mills. Lewis, you're uh, through, mate. Wait. It's the hair, my friend. Take a seat. It's not the hair. Why would I pick someone with hair? No, that's just my opinion. Nothing at all to do with hair. Got why or, then? Or just, jealousy. Just genuinely though, why 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 Lewis? Uh, he played the crowd when he came out, he waved to people, he interacted with the crowd. Uh, his facial expressions, even when he was getting his ass beat all over the ring, was brilliant. Um, and uh, He's funny and he was self-depreciating uh, as well. So we enjoyed that. A good sense of humor. Okay. Okay. One place left. Do I have to say it? You can be the bad guy. No. I'm going to do the I don't want to do the bad guy. Okay. I, Gizzy. I'll be the bad guy and choose the final winner and let everyone else down. Sorry, guys. Uh, we decided uh, the fourth person is going to be Tom, number two. Uh, sorry, everyone else. Uh, we just, we like Tom. Uh, he was good with like analyzing the game as well, as well as good at playing it. And uh, he had some good reactions. He was warm to watch, he was chill. And yeah, he was just a chill and humble guy. Okay. Tom, well done, my friend. Take a seat over there. Okay, I'm gonna do the special mention. Right. Okay, right. Commiserations, guys. Commiserations. Can we have a round of applause, please? Jason, would, would you like to say something? Nick. Yeah, we just, just, just want to say that uh, you remaining guys, uh, we really enjoyed watching you play. We really did. Uh, you were just pit to the post in little bits by, by, by the other guys. And I think also we have to do a special mention for Lily, who wasn't chosen because uh, she is forgetful and not good at checking email. Okay. So, yeah. Lily, I hope you've learned a lesson here today. I made a note that she, was, she didn't want to embarrass the competition. That's what I heard on Twitter. So... Okay. That's fair enough. We appreciate that. Okay. 
She you probably Lily. didn't want to play. It's only a game, who cares? Anyway, right, so, um, sorry guys, commiserations. You all did a fantastic job getting here in the first place. Enjoy the rest of the festival. Round of applause, please, for these guys. <laughs> Off you go, thank you so much. So, we're going to play 2v2 in Rocket League, okay? Because we're going to get our YouTubers involved. So, already, you've chosen Craig for reasons you've already explained. Yes. Uh, did you see him play Gangbeast? He's the best. Okay. Easy as that. Okay. Right. YouTubers. Uh, Tina, yes. Yes, hello. Out of all our YouTubers that uh, now have been chosen, who would you like to play Rocket League with? Uh, I'm going to pick Chris. You're going to pick Chris? Yes. Okay, go for it. Go and join Whoa. Chris. Chris, Tina likes you. Right. Raz, eventually, who are you going to play? Who are you going to choose? Why don't we flip a coin for it? Oh, you, you Do you know, have any money? So you, you're that nonplussed. <laughs> you're just going to flip it. You're going to leave it down to fate instead of... Okay, I'll take... Well, you really like Lewis, so I'll take Tom. Okay, you like Lewis, Raz. Okay, go, go join go Lewis. Tell him. Go, you've both got great hair. Oh. You were meant to be together. Come on, my boy, let's go. And then LD is with Tom. Okay, so first of all, can we get this guy some water, please? First of all, it is... Great, he's got water. Good. So it's Craig and Ray. Ray, have you played Rocket League before? Yeah, a little. I've played it like twice. I've dabbled. Okay. So it's Craig and Ray versus Tina and Chris. Hey. Okay, I think we're good now. Great, great. Okay, it's just going to be one game of Rocket League because we're a little okay. bit behind. My screen's a little. <laughs> we're good. We've and you're being filmed as well. Yeah, you're going to be on camera, so I would play up to that as much as possible. Bit of a tip. Same goes to you, Craig. We've got a camera. Oh, you'll be glad to know this if you're hungover. We've got a camera right in your face there. Okay, it's filming everything. Every little move you make, okay? It's just like one big eye right on your face. So basically, we're gonna get reactions. You're on, you're on camera now, actually. Just give us a wave. Give us a wave. Here we go. Okay. Yep, yep. Right, are we ready, chaps? Yep. Ready, guys? Let's go in. So Chris has a fez on. Here we go. Again, it's not entirely based on score. What team colours are we looking at? Orange and blue. I get it now. I'm a bit slow to take up these things, you know. That's okay. That's cool. It's been a long session. Don't worry. Yes. Yes. <laughs> right. The look of concentration. Is there? Oh, that's really nice. Look at that smiley face. So it's nil nil so far. I guess one thing to be looking out for if any of our um, contestants score, I guess that would be interesting, their reaction. Absolutely. Yeah. And the reaction of the, uh, the guy who didn't score. Yeah. Tears. Yeah. You want tears, Jason. We want, we want all the emotions. You want to see tears? Joy, pain, angst, yep. hate, okay. passion, yep. all of it. Okay. Crazy. Gizzy, what do you want to see out of this game of Rocket League? What are you looking for? Um, I'm just enjoying the game and who can entertain me the most, I guess. So I'm having fun watching it. Nick? I want, I want them to show me that they're having fun. Yeah, they're focusing on trying to win, but let's see what they're doing. Oh, someone scored. He's smiling. We're getting there. Yeah, we're getting on the replay here. Okay, I'll leave you to it. So, Chris, I'm going to have a little chat with you, okay, while you play. Because if you are going to be a winner, you need to get used to the attention, I suppose, okay? So, how are you feeling so far, Chris? Are you enjoying yourself? I'm enjoying myself. I just don't want to lose to a drunk. You just what, what? Don't want to lose to someone who's hungover. There is that, yeah. So you're not hung up. No, no. We have a goal. Was that, was that you guys? That was me distracting you, wasn't it? Basically. How do you feel about that? It's just a game. Why well, you have to be mad? Good answer. 
Let's go and chat to Craig. He knows I'm coming, doesn't he? Look, you can you can tell he's sensing me. <laughs> Craig, how are you feeling? Absolutely top. Absolutely top. Awful. <laughs> okay, the opposite of that. Right. Okay, good stuff. Um, are you enjoying yourself so far, even remotely? I don't know what I'm doing. You don't know what you're doing. What in in life or just at the moment? All of it. Okay. <laughs> there we have it. Judges are deep in conversation. Two minutes and 50 seconds left on the clock. Oh, I've just realized we're playing, we're playing rumble. So I think while these guys are playing, I'm going to remind them what they could potentially be winning, just to add a little bit more pressure to the proceedings. Yeah. So you guys are competing for a gaming PC worth over £1,500, a monitor from AOC, a peripheral set from Rockat, which includes a headset keyboard. Oh, is that it? You won? Oh, that was quick. We won. Okay. Oh, he's getting competitive there. I'm not sure how our judges feel about that. I think you did great. I'm going to chat to you both really quickly. Chris, so you're getting um, a little bit of abuse there, but you've, you seem to be handling it well. How are you feeling? Fine, there were two minutes left. We could have won. Okay. True, we're all true. true. Style, not skill. Tina's saying it's all about style, not skill. Yeah, exactly. We had all the best moves. Well, I think that's down to our judges to decide, but so far, okay, so good. Craig, looking smug. So, uh, it was a win, we'll give you that. Not all about winning, though. How are you feeling? Very hungover still. Okay. That has not changed. I noticed you were mocking Chris. Is that something you do on a regular basis, mock your competitors? <laughs> Is that something he does on a regular basis? Okay, thumbs up from the family there. Uh, it's something I do to everybody. I believe in equal rights. Okay, you're a mick taker. That's fine. He was a great teammate, though. Okay. Great teammate. Next game of Rocket League, please. Should we swap? Swap around. So Chris and Craig, take a seat on the couch. Round of applause, please. Let's do this. Okay, so as discussed, we have Raz. And Lewis, and over here, we have LD Shadow Lady and Tom. Do we have a team name yet? Yeah, we got this. No, our team name is Team No. Okay. <laughs> it's a good start. Wow, our judges are really... You are talking about this, aren't you? You're not just gossiping about... You are discussing the... Yeah. Last night's EastEnders. Right. Well, we got, we're going clubbing later and then shopping. You need some new Jimmy Choo's and you were going to get... And you need some new jeans from Next as well, didn't you? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, I, I like... The, you know what? Start? You guys are taking this very seriously. We are taking and I like right, that. That was pretty fast. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you're in. So, LD, you're on the main stage at Insomnia. <laughs> Did you not know what was going on? Um, I'm really bad at this game, and I would just like to apologise to Tom for putting him in this position. <laughs> oh, it doesn't matter, because it's not about gaming skills, is it? No, it's not. It's about passion. And actually, we were talking a bit of tactics before the game started, and um, he's very passionate about his games. He is. Tell him about, tell him about your rock band. Like, uh, I'm a really good rock band player at the minute. Uh, this is very difficult to play in. <laughs> yeah, it's very hard to multiply. I like that. Have you, are you getting this? Guys, guys, judges, are you getting this? Tom is an expert rock band player. I have a confession to make. Tom uh, did a charity 24-hour rock band stream with me two years ago. 
Ooh. We played solid. That's interesting. Hours. So I will be taking myself out of the decision process. That's interesting. He does a lot of work for charity, which always goes down well in my book. And he's a, and he's a rock band player as well. So yeah, I like that. I've got to say, I like a rock star. Is that it? Game over? What's that, Lewis? Game. One. You won. Oh, they won. Round of applause, please. Okay, so this is where it gets awkward. Guys, do you want to come and join us on the couch, please? Sorry, Tina, can I ask you just to stand behind just while we get our contestants on the couch? Yeah, Over you, yeah, take a seat. Come on, Craig, drag yourself up here. Very, I like that. Handshaking. Did you see that, judges? Okay. There we go. Can we get a round of applause, please, for all our contestants? Well done, everybody. Well done. I think you'll all agree when we say it's been a mad old hour. Right. First of all, let's get some final words from our players. Lewis, you turned it around, my friend. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. Yeah? Yeah. Nervous? Not so much now. Okay, but you enjoyed yourself? Yeah, very much so. And you're here for the rest of the weekend? Yes, I am, yeah. Okay, good stuff. Chris. Chris, 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 Chris. What did you think? Disappointed in myself for the last game, but you live and you learn. Win the next one. Win the next one. Confident. There isn't going to be a next one, just so you know. But still, the, the point is... We'll see. We'll do it in the BYOC. Do you play, are you BYOC this weekend? I am indeed. Oh, he's BYOC. He's old school. I'll give you that. Tom, my personal favourite, how are you doing? I'm actually doing not too bad. Yeah. Not too bad. Um, last game could have done a bit better, but I know, you know, I know my strengths, know my weaknesses, know where I can improve, you know. Oh, it's next time. Okay. You're a nice guy, Tom. Craig, are you happy to chat? Okay. How are you feeling, mate? But apart from hungover. Spectacular. Spectacular. That's good. We've evolved. Um, did you enjoy yourself? Yes. Make the most of it, because it's going to be over in like five minutes. Good. good. Embrace it. Right. So, the moment of truth. There can only be one. Judges? Hello. Feel free to give an opinion on everyone first if you want. It's up to you. Um, Unless you want to just announce our winner. Do you want to just announce the winner? Okay. We all so, want to get to the bar, let's do it. After much deliberation between us, very experienced and uh, intellectual. Oh, sorry, Jason. Talk more into your mic, mate. Bit louder. Um, so, <laughs> so, we've deliberated, we've looked at all the notes that we've made, and we have made a call on our choice for the ultimate gamer. And I, uh, I would like to announce the name of that contender. You forgot his name? No, I am, I'm building up the... I'm going to just hand you over to a colleague of mine. Okay. We I have mean, made a decision. Drag it out, guys. It's not a big deal. <laughs> uh, the ultimate gamer is going to be announced. Are you going to tell us? Else, not me. <laughs> you got to tell us why you chose this person, too. By the way, yeah. The ultimate gamer is. Oh, you got to say why. You got to say why. Oh. You guys, do you watch the um, X Factor? I mean, we need your opinions. He was. Good in front of the camera. He was also focused. Very ballsy joke. Fun. Very cool, yeah. He was jokey. He was funny. Um, the humility of the loss, shall we say? Ooh. Ooh. It was a pacing. But without further ado, Chris, oh! on your feet, sir. Well done, my friend. Whoa, look, a big check. Chris, I mean, you all deserve to be up here, but I've got to say, Chris, I think you are a deserved winner. You've got it all as far as I'm concerned. How are you feeling? I'm feeling absolutely amazing. I didn't expect to even be on this stage at the first place. Rounds on me for everyone who was competing. Oh, Woo! yes! Go, Chris! I like this guy. I think I'm going to cry. 
Does that include me? Yes! I love you! Right, okay, brilliant. Well deserved, mate. Shall I remind you what you've won? Yes. Because it always feels good, doesn't it? You've got a gaming PC worth over 1,500 pounds. You've got a monitor from AOC. You've got per a peripheral set from Rockat. That's a headset, keyboard, and mouse. You've got broadcasting kit from Razer. That's a microphone, webcam, and capture card. And you've got 1,000 pounds cash. Round of applause, please. OK. But it's not over yet. All the parents are like, really? No, it's not over yet, <laughs> because we have some peripherals from Rockat to give away to one of our guys still waiting. And it's going to be based on audience favoritism, okay? So you all need to join in on this, okay? Because I think certain contestants have more friends in the audience than others. So we need you all to join in, okay? Stand up, don't stand on your chairs, no health and safety. Make as much noise as possible, okay? We're gonna go through them one at a time. First of all, make some noise if you think Lewis should come second, go. Like that, well done. What about Tom, anyone? Interesting. And of course, we have Craig as well. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. I think it's quite obvious who's in second place. What? It's not you, no, Gizzy. Craig, up you come, mate. Everybody loves a hangover. Well done, mate. Congratulations. How does it feel? Uh, I don't even know what I've won. You've no idea what's going on. It's okay. Don't worry. Round of applause, please, for Craig. <laughs> Guys, handshake. We like that. You were all amazing. Tom, you're brilliant. So are you, Lewis. Well done, guys. YouTubers, thank you very much. Audience, you've been very patient. Thanks a lot. Judges, round of applause, please. Amazing stuff. So, uh, that is the end of the session, and it's the end of Insomnia 2. Uh, when you're leaving, please leave via the exit with the black and white stripes above it there. Yeah, it's just over there. Otherwise, you will never leave, okay? It's just down there. Thank you so much. Have a safe journey home if you're leaving. If you're back tomorrow, we will see you tomorrow. Have a great time. Thank you. Cheers. Goodbye. Hi, my name's Craig. I'm one of the leaders for the No Talent Gaming community. I'm meant to be making a video showing off my gaming achievements for the Insomnia's Ultimate Gamer Challenge. I don't have any gaming achievements. I'm pretty awful or mediocre at everything I do. That includes real life, mediocre and awful. I'm pretty okay at upsetting people, but I think that just comes with being Northern Irish. We're abrasive and awful to most people. That's just the way it is. Uh, I don't have anything else really to say, I just wanted to make a stupid video that was pointless and you had to watch and then realise it was a waste of your time. I want you to look at this desk though, I mean I'm 24 years old and I've got the desk of an 80 year old woman who uses a typewriter and still uses fucking telegrams. Now, I'll tell you this for nothing, I didn't buy this desk, there's a massive chance I've actually stolen this from an 80 year old woman, I don't know if she was sleeping or if she was walking it down the street or whatever but here it is and it's mine, tough. See you later.